Well, because that Harlem explosion happened so close to the Metro North tracks, commuting in and out of the city has been a struggle. Tonight, News 8's Stephanie Simone is trying to get back to Connecticut from the city. She, in fact, was trying to catch a train in the Bronx to get on a New Haven Line train. And Stephanie, I understand you're on the phone with us now. How's your trip home going? Hi, Anne. Yeah, I finally got on a train in Stanford on the shoreline east. Um, I left Grand Central Station at around 3.20, so uh, I'm scheduled probably to arrive in New Haven around 6 o'clock as my guest. And even though it just added a half hour to our trip, it has been a very hectic commute. We switched several trains, finally got to the Bronx, and once commuters got to the Bronx on the subway, they were dealt with, they dealt with serious, massive lines at Woodlawn. I mean, it went for blocks, and people were just waiting, kind of confused as to exactly what train was coming next, if they should get on it, because some of the trains were local to Stanford, others were, um, others were waiting for express trains. So it was kind of a chaotic scene. They beefed up security in the Bronx to try and handle those crowds. Um, and so we were just lucky and were able to get on a train uh, that was uh, local, and we got it to Stanford, and then we hopped onto the Shoreline East train, and that was really the best course of action. Otherwise, we'd probably still be waiting in that line in the Bronx. I feel bad. I know that uh, the train service has been restored from Grand Central Station, but I know there are plenty of people probably still waiting in the Bronx. I mean, when I talk about lines, it felt like people were trying to get into a concert or trying to funnel out of one. I mean, that's what it kind of looked like. Yeah. And yeah, uh, Stephanie Simona, you, thank you very much. It was a bottleneck all day today with all of those thousands of commuters stuck until just minutes ago when they said the lines had reopened again. Yeah, glad you're getting back home, Stephanie. Thanks.